all right guys welcome back so this word here is really 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 gonna help someone um it says here blessed are you when people insult you persecute you and falsely say all kinds of evil things against you because of me rejoice and be glad because great is your reward in heaven for in the same way they persecuted you they persecuted the prophets that was before you so this is where god he goes in furthermore and he speaks of salt and light and it says, for you are the salt of the earth, but if the salt loses its saltiness, how can it become salty again? It no, it's no longer good for anything except to be thrown out and trampled underfoot. You are the light of the world. A town built on a hill cannot be hidden. Neither do people light a lamp and put it under a bow. Instead, they put it on its own stand and it gives light to everyone in the house. In the same way, let your light shine before others that, you may, that they may see your good deeds and glory glorify your father in heaven so it doesn't matter what these people are saying or doing and i found these verses in matthew the fifth chapter starting from verse 11 all the way down to 15 so the lord is saying still be who you want to be it doesn't matter if these people persecute you it doesn't matter if they make false accusations against you that's what they're gonna do if you ever heard that old school saying they talked about jesus christ they're gonna talk about you they're gonna ridicule you but god is saying it does not matter be rejoice and be glad because the reward is great and it's in heaven and you already know once you get with the lord you know that you already in your promised land so be happy get glad and stay blessed. I love you guys. Until next time.